no, 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 no. That was a nicer fish. And there goes my yellow jacket fly. Hanging around. Nothing to do but frown. Rainy days and Sundays always get me down. No, actually this time, it got me to go trout fishing with dry flies for brown trout. Stay tuned. Beside the road again. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. Okay, I should, probably shouldn't even have to say this. I'm fishing a creek. I haven't fished in XX amount of years. It's been a long time, guys. It's been a long time since I've been down in here. Ooh, it's gotten all a little bit choked up more and changed, but what's happened is Saturday, I was gonna do a recon mission for smallmouth bass. Of course, the way that's been going lately, it's probably wasn't a good idea, but it was close to where I had to pick my wife up from her mother's. So I chose it, and it was a total disastrous bomb. Zilt zero goose egg. That was yesterday, Saturday. Today is Sunday. I just got out of church, took the crowd out to eat, scrambled around real quick, got my stuff together. I've only got a couple of three hours max. It's gonna get dark, it's rained. Got a rain jacket on, cause it's probably gonna get chilly with that being wet. This upper part, I used to fish a lot back in my 20s. And, well, I'm gonna go back and try it again. If I can get to the creek. This'll be interesting. I uh, hope it didn't rain a lot upstream. Let's take a look, see what it looks like. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Looks good. Let's go catch some fish. And we caught our first leaf. Oh yeah, it's gonna get worse and worse over the next month. Oh, there we go. Oh, he got off. He wasn't big, but he wasn't a dink either. It was not a micro trout. It was not a micro trout. I didn't set the, I am not setting the hook hard enough on these fish. Come on, fish. You just felt the stinger. That was it. Still a good meal, dude. He's like, I ain't buying. Look, I was born at night, but not last night. Well, oh, that's positive, though, guys. I had a what would be that was probably a seven incher which means he was legal that illegal trout come up and hit my dry fly so that bodes well hopefully the rest of them will <laughs> here he goes ah he ain't big but okay this is probably going to be about average oh a little brown a little brown nice little brown because they colored up really good thank you sir that was worth coming up here and doing no he wasn't big dang it he was there Ah, that's like a good pull. Got a lot more depth than those other ones. Oh, oh, nice trout just went right by there. I mean like 12 inches, maybe. What did he, what was he? I don't know. He went up through there, somewhere. Oh yeah, there he goes. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Wet your hands. I'm fishing in the rain. My hands are already wet. Okay, a little bigger. We're getting bigger, guys. 
That doesn't all, oh, that brown, look at, oh man, that is a beautiful fish. Woo! Yeah, buddy, that's what I came here for. All right, all right. Man, look at the leaves. Are the fish even gonna see the fly? I don't know, that's a good question. Hey, there we go. Good drift, good drift. Right in the sweet spot. Man, these yellow jackets have been amazing. Past couple of months. <laughs> like I said. <laughs> Little bit smaller than that last one, but okay, he flopped out of my hands and I, I, I uh, anyway, doesn't matter. Man, it's hard to see with this rain and the glare. Let's see where I put my feet, that's not healthy. Oh yeah, I forgot about the waterfall. <laughs> we might not fish that far. Guys, this is probably going to be a short video. <laughs> Man, that was, a, that was a rapid bam. Not the same as these others. Not big yet. At least I got to show you that one. <laughs> Sorry about all those water droplets. I think I got it cleaned off good. We'll find out. Well, y'all will find out. We'll both find out. Here we go. Oh, yeah, buddy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Brown's a jump, dude. Well, it's a rainbow, man. They jump more than others, and uh, they do on average. But that don't mean that old Mr. Brown ain't going to jump every now and then. Yeah, buddy. Oh, that's what I'm talking about right there. That's the biggest one so far. Maybe, maybe 10 inches. And the brown trout, let's see, it's early October. Brown trout are gonna start spawning here soon, very soon. So they're probably feeding up. The spawn. I just cleaned the lens off. It's probably already wet. Need a way to do this in the rain. Dang it! Come on. Ah, I got time for this rod fly leader. Hey, I can't see nothing. If I see the strike, it'll be a miracle, guys. Be a miracle. Man, just got to the really big, nice pool. And the rain just starts going down harder and harder. And my fly is soaking wet in fish slime, which is a good thing, but not like it's sticking out among all the debris. Which there's a lot of debris. Ah! <laughs> I love it. Man, I used to do this all the time. I'd fish very, very uh, popular rivers while it was raining. Because everybody else done gone home. I hope it's helped. It ain't making it worse. <laughs> ah. Ain't gonna be much longer. I'm gonna have to high tail it. Oh, yeah, it's a bigger fish, I think, guys. I think so. I think we got a bigger fish. 
No, he's about the size of the biggest one I've caught so far. Where'd he go? Well, I, I can't find him. There you go. Another brown. I'd forgotten. There's, oh, oh, sorry about that. He got loose. Dang it. Ah, he's a, I, he wasn't the big. He wasn't as big as the biggest, but he's still in there. Same rough size. Ah. Now these fish have been willing to go. They've been willing to rock. I love it. What's funny is all this debris in the water, you think they just wouldn't even look up. You know? But no. These fish are coming. That fish came out of about three, four feet of water. I'm going to try something. That's my butt. Yeah. I'm trying to keep the line off that faster water. And get over there on that other side a little bit. Oh! No! No, 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 no! That was a nicer fish. And there goes my yellow jacket fly. <laughs> That, my friends, is a fish story. Guys, I hope you've enjoyed this rainy, wet soap two hours. Caught what, five maybe? I don't know. I didn't catch a single micro trout. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to Micro Trout Anonymous and I'm getting better. Anyway, guys, thank you for coming. And see you on the water sometime is that beautiful or what guys just fall is just starting we come from way down there yeah i love it <laughs> rainy days and mondays always get me down Okay, guys, now for the uh, get me down part of the song. <laughs> Why did I not make a fishing video on Saturday instead of Sunday? Saturday, I went on another smallmouth bass fishing, wading the river recon mission. Should have known better. <laughs> of late, that, that is a sure formula for disaster. If you guys hanging this long in the video, I'm going to show y'all some really beautiful clips of some really beautiful water. It was clear, conditions were perfect, it was really nice, and the fish would not cooperate. And I heard from other people that that same weekend, a buddy of mine went fishing on that same river way upstream, and uh, this guy's a very good smallmouth fisherman, and he had a, he, he said he boated a few well when mr robbins only boats a few man it was tough so i feel better but still got me down but anyway <laughs> here's a few clips guys i threw the kitchen sink i literally threw well <laughs> i threw i threw i threw a clouser that was almost as heavy as a kitchen sink <laughs> I, I threw i threw everything i had got one bike I got one bite, and that was off of a uh, Helgramite, a, a, a big Helgramite nymph. I may show a picture. But, guys, it was tough. It was, I uh, hiked in a mile on railroad tracks, found a way to the river. Man, it was good. You could wade. There was a spot where you could literally wade completely across the river. And I tried, guys, I tried, I mean, nothing. I did not land a single fish. But, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the picks. And uh, just to let you know that it happens. I mean, it's it's you're gonna have those days. You're gonna you're gonna have a week. You're gonna have a whole month when you just can't buy a fish. You go to the grocery store and say, "Throw the fish to me. Let me catch it, so I can say I caught the fish." And, and they're gonna go, 
Oh, we're all out of fish. <laughs> it was that kind of week. Not the week to buy a lottery ticket. <laughs> Guys, thanks for watching. See you on the water sometime.